can somebody explain to me how in the hell Deontay Wilder is the number one WBC heavyweight contender? Especially since, you know, boxing is racist and shit. Can somebody explain this to me? Yeah, I thought so. Coming off a <laughs> knockout loss, right? Two knockout losses. Beating a guy that, in the interim, that was knocked out by him. Meanwhile, you got Joe Joyce, undefeated, has had some pretty good victories lately. You got Joseph Parker, just came back, beat Chisora pretty impressively, right? But no, Deontay Wilder is the number one WBC guy. Why is that? Anyway, the WBC... Oh, give the video a like, comment, sub, check out my Patreon. We'll, we'll get to the uh, Usyk Joshua fight. Be patient. Um, I got to simmer on that. Anyway, and that was a reference to my uh, Patreon. So go check it out. Um, the WBC gave Tyson Fury until Friday to decide if he's retired or not blah 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 he is he said he was retired months ago and he just confirmed it the other day he's retired but i guess they needed in writing blah 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 so they could make it official so that they in my opinion can make deontay wilder versus helenius for the wbc strap right i mean you know it'd be a total diss to joyce and parker right but at the same time, Deontay Wilder is the number one contender. So <laughs> go figure how that happened. But there it is, the WBC. And Hellenius is within the top 10. So everything is A-OK. -okay. No uh, legal red tape to cross here, probably. I don't know what the hell the rules are. And they probably change depending on what it is. But what it is, is the number one, the number nine, barely within the top 10 guy, uh, you know, for the WBC title, if Tyson Fury bottles it like he has a tendency to do, has done in at least in two different instances in his career. So uh, after Tyson Fury poops his pants and says, no, uh, I don't want to, you know, be, I am retired. Take this strap off of me. I don't know. And is is this too much of a stretch for you guys? What do you think? I mean, it seems to make sense to me. They'll probably put that belt on the line, and then Deontay Wilder will fight Usyk. I think. Why wouldn't he? You know what I mean? Um, and um, that would be something else, wouldn't it? Maybe not exactly just, but. You know, that's just boxing for you. Now, they could make Joyce and Parker for the WBC belt. And that would make more sense. That would be more fair. That would be the winner of that fight. What would be a better challenge for Usyk, right? Joe Joyce. Um, but, you know, the WBC works in mysterious ways. And um, they are sure to not disappoint. So I'm going to say it. If the gypsy queen over here bottles it like he has a tendency to do, which he may not. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Ooh, can't wait till Friday. Uh, there's going to be some moves going on here in the WBC. And just the fact that even though he's coming off a loss, a devastating one at that, where he got knocked out, right? Two of them, actually, in fact. And yet, somehow, he's their number one guy. Uh, that's... I don't know. I don't know. Just call me a conspiracy theorist. You know what I mean? But this shit is looking kind of funny. Uh, but it is what it is. And what it is is uh, boxing. So come on, Tyson. Let us know. Will you allow somebody else to pick up that strap? Or will you grow a pair and fight Usyk? All this talk about, you know, Open up the checkbook or, you know, I need however many millions I need. Get out of here, man. This, this is, come on, man. This is the Mayweather blueprint. This is, it's weak, okay? This is, it's weak. Anyway, 
I'm calling it now, man. This, the WBC is going to make some moves, and it's most likely going to be Deontay Wilder and Hellenius. Now, they could make Wilder versus have a little tourney, I guess. Wilder, Hellenius, Joyce Parker. That would make the most sense. But then again, you know, I suppose Usyk could fight a Mando in the interim. So that'd be cool. You know what I mean? But um, if that is what they're doing, I hope they get everybody to sign whatever contracts they need to sign in order to keep Tyson Fury out of the picture. Because if they make him champion emeritus or whatever, he could come in at any point during this little tournament and just spoil the party. And Come on, man. We don't need that. He already uh, is responsible for two, three undisputed fights at heavyweight. Not happening, at least partially responsible. So, uh, whatever. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be Wilder. Can Hellenius be Wilder? Yeah, if he comes to win, will he? I have a feeling he's going to be walking into punches like Brazil or Dillian White. So, I'm calling it now, man. This some some Something's happening here. Now, Tyson Fury could... Throw a monkey wrench in the WBC plans, but um, it's kind of what it's looking like to me. So we'll see what happens. Uh, it'll be interesting, if nothing else. Thanks for watching.